Are you grateful every day? Each morning, my I read a short daily devotional, and my name is Heidi Cole, to encourage you in God's truth and His Word. My heart is truly for that busy mom, busy woman, who doesn't have time each day to turn her focal point back to God. I know, because I've been there. But if men want to tune in, you are more than welcome. Thank me for my glorious gift of my spirit. This is like priming the pump of a well as you bring me the sacrifice of thanksgiving regardless of your feelings. My spirit is able to work more freely within you. This produces more thankfulness and more freedom until you are overflowing with gratitude. I shower blessings on you daily, but sometimes you don't perceive them. When your mind is stuck on a negative focus, you see neither me nor my gifts. In faith, thank me for whatever is preoccupying your mind. This will clear the blockage so that you can find me. Okay, in 2 Corinthians 5.5, 5, Now the one who has fashioned us for this very purpose is God, who has given us the Spirit as a deposit, guaranteeing what is to come. In 2 Corinthians 3.17, Now the Lord is the Spirit, and where the Spirit is, the Lord is, there is freedom. And Psalms 50.14, Offer to God a sacrifice of thanksgiving, and pay your vows to the Most High. So are you grateful every day? Um, as, we, as I've been journeying on this Bible study and personal development, I've really been challenged to um, how important it is to write down what you are grateful for each day. And right here we are being told that thankfulness produces more thankfulness and freedom until you're overflowing with gratitude. So I'm just continuing to see that God wants us to be grateful and thankful and to see our blessings. And um, so what I'm going to do is I want to challenge you. You know, I mean, you don't have to do it, but I want to challenge you for your personal self to, um, just as I have been challenged, that every day write down three to five things to be thankful for and grateful for. And you will be surprised at how it'll change your negative thinking because that's what God wants us to do. Clear out our negative thinking so that we can see his blessings. So if there is anything that we can pray for you, we would love to be praying for you. If you have found value in this, then please share it with someone. And thanks and have a blessed day.